yeah. It's one of those days getting out the aspirin and stuff. I just got off the phone with some really nice young people which starting their own real estate business. And they went to some guru who told them to take all, after they paid him all the money, now they're supposed to do a mailer. You guys know how I feel about postal mailers. Here we are in the age of social media and we're still mailing letters to people who don't even go to the post office anymore, okay? But the thing that really got me is their business is just starting and they have a lot of energy and intelligence and enthusiasm. And then the guru advised them to give all their phone calls from all their mailers to a virtual assistant in a distant land so that they could then filter it down and then give them the lead. And my advice is that's, that's nuts, that's ludicrous. It's insanity, ladies and gentlemen. When you have a startup business, you talk to as many people as possible. You make sure all those leads go directly to you, duh. Why would you wanna give your leads for your business that can make you a lot of money to someone who doesn't have your skill set, your intelligence, your knowledge of real estate or widgets or whatever. You take responsibility for your business. You talk to the people directly. I'm not against automation. I'm not against hiring other people in other countries and all that other stuff. But if you're just starting your business and you're treating it like a hobby instead of a business, after all the time and investment and everything you've done, you're doomed to fail. I'm sorry, I don't like to be a negative guy. I'm, you know me, I'm happy-go-lucky Uncle Claude. I'm a positive guy. The glass is always half filled with me. But somebody better start telling the truth out there. You've got to take responsibility of your business. As the sign says, you've got to give good phone. You've got, if you're going to do the marketing, talk to people directly, have good adult-to-adult -adult conversations, learn the gut sales method, learn how to ask questions, use your skill set, your power of persuasion and influence to get people to say, what, is it, what do you want them to say? You want them to say, I like him, I like her. They, I, they feel, I feel like they could trust him, I like them. Let's do business with them. That's all you're going for. But if you give it to somebody who doesn't have a command, who English is not their native tongue, and they're just taking information, you're gonna turn off people before you ever get started. Take responsibility for your business, talk to as many people as possible, make sure in a beginning marketing plan that you get all calls directly to you because nobody can do it better than you. And you can't automate everything until you're up and running and you're making money. This is, Claude telling you nobody deserves success more than you, but stop listening to people who are giving you bad advice. When it doesn't make sense, there's a reason for it. Hey, I do answer my own phone, 970-281-5151. I won't do any more of these kind of depressed videos, but sometimes we got to talk. We have to speak about the truth. And in business, treat it like a business, and you'll see magic happen every day. I know because I'm living that dream right now. And if I can do it, I'm nobody special. I know you can do it too. 970-281-5151 or go to my webpage or give me a thumbs up and all that other good stuff. Love to speak with you. Take care.